Hello ladies and gentlemen, I have some more good news. I've got the yaw all together and uh, hooked up, all Wi-Fi'd in. I stole my son's iPad and I got the app on that because I have the app on my phone, but I can't film and use the app at the same time, so I just put the app on there. Super easy, it hooks up to anything instantly. You don't need any pass weird passwords or anything. So we'll get to that. Here it is. All wired in. There's your USB. There's your emergency safety pull. This is your Hotaz USBs. Thrustmaster E10. There's your five point harness. Pimax AK. Pull to eject. TPR pedals. Butt kicker. Throttle. Left-handed mouse, bolted down, ready to go. So the unit plugs into the wall, bottom unit plugs in, the bottom unit powers the top unit through the center mount. Also the USBs hook up that way. The white cable is a USB to the computer for your uh, SIM shaker type software stuff. So. And uh, I don't even have that hooked up. You can test it independently of your PC. Oh, again, the uh, police car laptop mount modified into a keyboard mount. So she's ready to go. Um, all we got to do is the actual PC game tuning now. So now I'm going to show you um, a test, a manual, a uh, couple different tests that it has in the app. There are... Manual, random, you have all your yaw pitch, you can control the amplitude, you can do a gyro, which is, I'm going to show you that too in a minute. But right now, what we're going to do is we're going to go on random, right? So you hit random, or you hit random for me. So it'll say yes or no, wait, 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 now. So here is your answer to whether or not these have a lot of power. Jax, go ahead and hit start. It just does random movements. We'll do a gyro. This thing can really whip. It's not doing anything right now, but... We'll just watch it for a second here. I gotta get that squeak taken care of. I don't think that squeak would be too noticeable. I'll bet it'll go away, but we'll see. So yeah, things to know. This thing is very, very fast when it wants to spin. I don't know why it's not doing it. See if you can get it to spin, Jax. Uh, I can't, you want me to do manual? Yeah, go to manual. All right, manual. So do not lift it up, lay it down. I want you to lay the screen down. You're on gyro. You're on gyro. You can see what he's doing here. Stop touching it. Stop touching it. He is on gyro mode right now. So you can see how the iPad is laying flat on the floor. Watch this. If I can get this in the screen. The iPad works as a gyro. So... Watch what happens when I move the iPad here. All right, now roll it. I'll see if I can roll it. See how it moves when I'm, I'm rolling it? Now I'm gonna pitch it up. It's just like you're using your hand to control it. Pitch it down, left, right, whatever. This is a terrible angle on the film, but you get the point. It's really cool. You can like just gyro control it. So you got that. Now we'll go back to what you do is you hit stop. And then see, we could do test ride. We haven't ridden it yet because we wanted to just see it go. So we'll go back to random. Why does this not? There we go. All right. Yeah, watch it here. And I have the amplitude. You can turn the limits of the movement down. 
uh, in all aspects, pitch, roll, yaw, the whole bit. You can make it not do 360s if you want. It can stay straight. But, uh, yeah. So, it's kind of, I don't know why it doesn't want to do the 360. I'll try to do it manually. No, you can't do it from there manually. Okay. Stop. We'll stop. We'll go to manual, and I'll yaw it. Off gyro. <laughs> yeah. So now, oh, you have to stop. Off gyro. I gotcha. Get random, right? It, forgot. it sucks, man. All right, now yaw. Go ahead and push that yaw back and forth slowly. See, there's your yaw. Go all the way around. Do it fast. Show them. Okay, there you go. Now kind of go a little faster. We have the limits on, so it's governing itself. But you'll see how I got the cables rigged up. There's your extendo cord. It's all perfect, right? Nothing hits anything. All right, stop. So that's kind of cool. And, you know, that's about it. The app is quite simple. Um, I'll go through the pages here to explain what we're looking at, right? So this is like your main screen. You double tap to start and stop. You've got telemetry you can save, all your network information, all kinds of fun stuff there. Here's your test ride. This is like the last page of the app. Let me go the other way. So like first page, then you can start and stop, double tap. So you see I have the vibration off because I have my own seat with my own haptic chair. So I don't need their internal software vibration that's probably just for their seat. So that's off. Power's on high. You can control the power of the unit. Slider. Um, here's your limits on your yaw and pitch. Now watch. You'll see how that moves. You're limiting your, whoops, you're limiting this back and forth, and obviously you can do that for everything. When you start, turn these down. Get them down in the middle like this, because you don't want the thing going to its maximum reach right off the bat in case you got something weird with your build or something's tight. You're going to smack it or hurt it, so... Limit it uh, quite uh, extensively, and then play with it, and then push your limits once you know what's going on. So effects, running lights, you got all these LED stuff. I ain't even worried about any of that crap. Um, calibration offset. So like you can see, watch, I'll hit the balance indicator, and it kind of like weighs itself. Boom. So you see how I got that? That's with my 45 pounds of homemade lawnmower weights on there. Check out my calibration on that. Not too shabby. And then, uh, you know, manually calibrate it if you want, whatever. Center position, you got all this little info. Oh. And again, test mode, the last page. You can control manually with your fingers on the sliders. Make it do what you want to check it. Um, the gyro is, like I said, when you turn this on, if the iPad would work. Wow, dude. Thing sucks. Okay. So you got your gyro on. Again, watch. I'm going to pick this up. It's not is it on? Turn it on. Turn on manual. Now watch my hands. literally gyroing with with the ipad it'll do it with your phone too all right so yeah she works like a charm it's ready to go um i'm gonna do uh, a video right after this with the blue lights on in here so you guys and some dcs sounds and whatnot so you guys get an idea of what the flight sim environment will be like when we're really going at it here so check it out i'm gonna film that video right now it'll be up in a minute too have a good night. Thanks for watching.